Well, that's awesome. Uh, I'm going to talk about my wife, actually. She's been the only person I probably talk about tonight. So here it goes. Um, I met her when I was 13. It's this crazy love story that uh, should be some movie that I can't make, right? We was in this church group. She was like this really gracious like woman already at 13. <laughs> and then I moved away, and I joined the Army. Fast forward 10 years, I'm jumping out of an airplane. I'm really scared, and I have this vision of this girl that I haven't seen in 10 years, and it's my future wife. And it's a very calming, calming moment and a uh, really trying time. Fast forward again, she's now in New York. We're kind of writing letters back and forth. I'm in Afghanistan, and we start to really get to know each other. Um, it's a really wonderful way to meet her as an adult. Fast forward again, we have our first kiss at JFK baggage claim. We basically move right in together. <laughs> and that's usually where I end that story, because it's, it's just really beautiful. But the fact of the matter is that there's a lot more to that story. There's things that are embarrassing, and there's hardships. And um, there's a year after I got out of the Army where I didn't do anything. I sat in a room, and I was really scared. And my wife supported us. And it was incredible. She's an incredibly strong woman. I see her right now. Um, <laughs> When, when you lose confidence in yourself, it's, uh, it is a hard thing to gain back. And when you think that someone is so great the way that I think she is, you know, it's <laughs> having someone like her think that you're actually worth something is really wonderful. It can pull you out of that. And uh, I just, if I was going to talk about anybody, I got to talk about you. You know what I mean? I love you, baby. Thank you so much.